The Philippine Coast Guard, or PCG, will dispatch a ship to Razul Reef and Escoda Shoal, along with marine scientists from the University of the Philippines Marine Science Institute, to investigate the cause of coral destruction in these two reefs situated within the exclusive economic zone of the Philippines. The PCG is seeking information regarding the possibility of significant damage and identifying those responsible for it. We cannot um, really um, say uh, the motivation of whoever uh, dumped those uh, crash corals in uh, Escoda Shoal. Uh, this uh, primary, uh, primarily the reason why we need um, maritime scientists to evaluate uh, and also to get sample um, for us to really understand the objective uh, of those uh, dump crash corals um, in Escoda Shoal. In the underwater video released by the PCG, it is evident that the corals are no longer present in the area and crushed corals have been dumped. Although the PCG does not have a video showing that the Chinese maritime militia did this, based on their monitoring, the CMM vessel was seen in the area before the corals were destroyed. The PCG reports the discovery of 48 Chinese maritime militia vessels at Rozul Reef and Escoda Shoal from August 9 to September 11 of this year. But uh, if you're going to ask me kung meron ba tayong naaktuhan na Chinese maritime militia vessels na pinapatay nila ang coral to whatever activities na ginagawa nila dyan, we don't have any. But uh, in terms of circumstances, uh, that's the only thing we, we, we are uh, sure for now. Uh, na nung panahon na tumambay sila dyan, when we did, right after that, when we did the underwater survey, ito yung ating nakita. The PCG emphasizes that Filipino fishermen are the most affected by the destruction of these reefs as they rely on these areas for fishing. The seabed resources, supposedly ang uh, mag-exploit uh, at mag-explore nito ay uh, sabayan ng Pilipino. But with this kind of damage, um, marine ecosystem, it will also affect our uh, um, fisher folks, no, uh, sa pangingis na nila. Um, this, the scientific side of it, uh, I would refer that to uh, marine scientists 